Like the age-old crack of a bat, the soundtrack of baseball now includes actual songs known as walk-up music. I would describe it as the theme song of a baseball player to show off a little bit of personality or they like to excite the crowd. Austin Hutchison runs the website MLB Plate Music and says the competition for the newest hits can be intense. Anytime new music drops during the season, players try and claim that as their song. So they want to be the first to hop on a new release. Here's the thing, we're talking about walk-up music, but we can't actually play the songs without spending thousands and thousands of dollars. So whenever we mention a title, I'll be singing it in karaoke. Giddy up. Drake has been by far the most popular artist. They're trying to take the wave from a, whoa, can't say that on TV. He's put out so much music in the last two or three years. Energy was extremely popular. Next, walk-ups probably don't have much impact on new music sales, but they can keep classic songs in play. You hear a lot of classics that get some special attention from the players and the crowd loves it. My walk-up song is Your Love by The Outfield. Josie's on a vacation far away. It's kind of an 80s throwback thing, and that way I don't have to keep picking the newest cool song I can just pick something a little more classic and just let it ride it's not always classics or even existing songs some players commissioned originals Yasiel Puig of the Los Angeles Dodgers had original music created for himself by a friend of his who goes by Mr. Criminal Yasiel Puig number one in the league and that's enough of that so what walk-up songs might we hear in 2016 I think you're gonna hear a lot of players use Adele's hit song hello from the other side hello Maybe as a joke? It's me. Bottom line is, no matter what you do, doctor, accountant, construction worker, everyone should have walk-up music. It's what's the deal. That must have gone a mile. I can't even see it.